post-mortem William W. Shakespeare. This feels like a conversation between one and one left behind, about the verse written by the one now gone. It would be fine to compare them to more modern styles, and even like another, but honour these words for the expression of love they were written with. I think this is also a rejoinder to any reader of the future, like us. The request is that if you are reading these lines after me, and I'm fine with knowing that, I had a good life, remember me with the verses I have written. And the reply, it is possible the writer of the verse would have done differently if given more time, and new and wonderful writings have come along, and their words will be enjoyed in the style they are written, but the words of the dead poet will be read and remembered in the voice of that one so beloved. Postmortem if thou survive my well-contented day, when that churl death my bones with dust shall cover, and shall by fortune once more resurvey these poor rude lines of thy deceased lover. Compare them with the bettering of the time, and though they be outstripped by every pen, Reserve them for my love, not for their rhyme, Exceeded by the height of happier men. O, oh, then vouchsafe me but this loving thought, Had my friend's muse grown with this growing age, A dearer birth than this his love had brought, To march in ranks of better equipage. But since he died, and poets better prove, Theirs for their style I'll read, his for his love.